Yeah, it's my third year doing NC2As. You get used to going back to back to back, and when you train for it, you know your body just you adapt to it. So um, I was all right with the time. There's still some areas to. There's a lot of areas to improve on it. So I'm looking forward to next year, and I think that was my last 50 of the meet. I'm not sure, but yeah, that was my last lead off 50 of the meet. So I'm excited. Um, the time's good, and like you said, pretty consistent. Yeah, it's always nice to go personal best. Um, like I said, at this point, it's just having that perfect race, not even a perfect race, just nailing some certain areas that I need to get better at and just perfecting those. What um, are Breakout, second breakout, and just being cleaner off the dive. My dive, I was a little sloppy tonight, and second breakout, and I completely missed my finish, but that's okay. <laughs> so did anything actually go right? Yeah, no, 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 it was a good swim, don't get me wrong. I just, being picky, that's yeah. just part of the sport. Um, I'm actually a second, no, no, I'm one less stroke than I was last year. I, I was eight okay. strokes going out this year, nine strokes last year. So that's just more power and you have to get used to how your body responds. Like getting bigger in the weight room is gonna make you stronger in the water and it's gonna be less strokes. So you gotta kinda nitpick and figure out stuff that works best for you and do it in practice. Oh, it's great. Um, you almost had eight guys under 19 in the final at the NC2A I meet. It's, it's getting ridiculously fast. And like Willa Cohen said, it's getting stupid fast. Like that's ridiculous. If, you go 19-1 and you're not even making the A final at this meet. So it's just you gotta keep going and the meet's just getting faster and faster. It's crazy. I got a lot of uh, I think I got a lot of wisdom out of it, you know, it's such a big meet and it doesn't make these meets seem smaller. It gives you a bit more confidence in how to handle adversity and you know, being up on that podium like you said, you know, you just get to handle things better because when that meal's just that meet's just on such a big scale, you just get in a better routine with meets like this.